and welcome back to Barony Bridge again, where uh, we are building a nice and cozy park, which it has a very, very compact building style uh, so far. And uh, to be honest, I think it's um, quite adding to our success, because look at how few space we... I don't think that's even proper English, but I mean, the amount of space we used is like, you know, not all that much. So especially if we look over here, I think we haven't even used up like half of our space that we have available. Well, well, I guess we're also halfway, so I guess we're doing actually quite all right. However, the last time I said that we were gonna run into problems, well, those problems are getting more and more imminent because um, look, this is what we just built, <laughs> and now we have nothing to build. However, that's coming on the 16th of June, which is like now. <laughs> uh, okay, that's good. Um, but after that we won't have anything to build and believe me uh, this is going to be built really quickly so uh, what I'll do is I'll put this back to roller coasters because um, I also want to build another roller coaster we only have four and uh, that's like average but it needs to be more so now another thing that I guess whined about while I was building uh, the uh, really cool sea mine is that the state of our path was supposed to be disgusting. So let's see if they were right about it. I don't think they were. I think they were lying. Lying little sons of pixels. Yep. I think it's all really nice and tidy actually. <laughs> if you ask me. <laughs> I've had I've seen parks that were far worse than this. Yeah, no, they're just whining for the whining. Alright, so, um, then, another thing that I kind of want to see, and this is more, you know, I never actually took a look at this stuff. So, I'm kind of curious. I know we're on max loan, that's good though. I don't mind that. And this though, look, see it's fluctuating. However, on average, we make like seven grand more or less a month. It's quite decent, actually. We spend a lot as well. Mm, this is all meh, meh. So in the end, yeah, we make like three grand a month. I think that's pretty, pretty damn decent. Ah well. Anyway, um, yeah, we need to build stuff. So let's unpause the game for that. Look, new stuff. <laughs> Told ya. <laughs> um, yeah, let's put this like over here. Actually, let's just you know cram it in over here. Perfect spot for it. Now I'll have the entrance be over there and the exit be over there. Very, very good. And then I'll hook this up first. And then we are really gonna... Oh, it's... Oh, <laughs> of course. <laughs> Alright, short queue it is then. <laughs> you know, compact building. Uh, oh, crap. This is the wrong kind of path. Compact building for the win. Good. Now then. Now that we have this right, I'm really a bit like, you know, what am I gonna do? after we build this and as you can see this goes amazingly fast uh, let's do this now because <laughs> apparently I've been forgetting to do that <laughs> for like most of the rides yeah put that on the max put this on five bucks and BAM done then what yeah then what <laughs> well coloring for one um, so, how about we give this a blue... No, 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 let's go with green. No, let's... We can make this blue. However, we're gonna make this green. So it doesn't stand out at all. <laughs> no. Yeah, that at least stands out. I like that black, but... Uh, yeah, this is what I want to make blue. Or not? No, it's way too, way too much of it. Yeah, I guess we could not go with that. Yeah, that 
that is the color that we will go with. And yellow. It's not all that much yellow in it anyway. And it's nice. It fits with our uh, color theming. So, now that we have this, why don't we call this the yellow sledge. Yellow edge. The yellow sledge. <laughs> yeah. No? Wordplay. I like it. Alright, in the pocket. All we need to do now is get a new handyman for our new ride. And we're covered. And then we need to start considering seriously our balls. I don't know what I assigned them to, but let's just pray that I have assigned him. You know what? I think I double clicked on a few areas. So we're gonna hire a new handyman. You will have this area, this area, this area, this area. It's just for the future, really, and that. Now at least I know he has uh, the right stuff assigned to him. You know what? Let's get a new security guard out there and a new elephant. <laughs> I think, uh, you know, we're getting big now, so we can afford this. But, man, there is literally nothing for us to bid. I'm just not gonna bid this because I don't think we can make anything decent out of it. Hmm, wait. I'm not gonna bid this because this is useless, but this, coming to think of it, I think that this is the only thing we can build. And yeah, you know what? This will be the final ride that we built over here in this space, in this area. I'll hook it up to over here actually, so there's at least something there for guests coming in from that angle. And this will be the last thing we built, and then <laughs> we're gonna wait a year, <laughs> no, uh, but um, then we will move on to the other side of the park, really, because uh, we still got a complete other side to fill up with marvelous stuff, or at least well, that is if our researchers ever get around to researching something useful. However, I think that, yeah, let's go with a little bit more station length. Okay, <laughs> let's not go with a little bit more station length. But... Now, since in our last video I tried to get in the good habit of building this stuff first. Balls, I need this to be here. So, Alright, now that's okay actually, because I can have the exit be over here and have the queue go over there actually. Yes. Wow. 12 high, so it can make a 5 high drop. Bonkers mad, really. <laughs> <laughs> That's really epic, man. <coughs> Not. <laughs> uh, let's see. Can we, like, S-band this and get a little bit more oomph in it? Yeah, it seems so, actually. Okay. Well, well there we have it. All right. <laughs> yeah, it needs to have at least two drops. For one, because otherwise it won't get back to the station. And for two, because... <laughs> Man, it's dull as it is right now. So let's have another S-band. Oh, this is an interesting way. I need this to be like one further out here. Because now, look, we go below our own stuff. And all I need to do really is see that I get this somehow back to uh, the station. Well, this seems quite an interesting idea to me, actually. No, we're not convoluting up this area here. We are having a really bad drop, though, with the curve straight after it, but I can live with that. I don't mind bad drops. I consider this to be one of the worst rides you can build. I said it about quite a lot of <laughs> rides, actually. But then again, they are also really bad. I know, because I am right. <laughs> well, if you ask me, I am. Um, yeah, so... Let's get... No, wait. <laughs> Why not, actually? <laughs> yeah, I never even, you know, I thought, you know, about leaving this intact. But I guess, why not? 
it's there. <laughs> it does undermine a bit of the whole bridge thing. Nah, you know what? Let's go in style here. Let's leave the bridge support pylons intact. Otherwise, I mean, the bridge might collapse. <laughs> Not that it has any support under, under the other paths, but hey, you know. Roleplay. Yep. Roller coaster tycoon roleplay. Ah, balls. Okay, good. So, lock fume. Go and test ride. And then be open straight away for five bucks. I don't expect much of it really, to be honest. But, um, and I do need to, you know, set this up with proper timings and whatnot. Because otherwise, we're going to have whiny guests. No. If there's one thing I don't like, it's just whining about stuff that's... Well, I guess <laughs> it is actually a valid thing to complain about, but... Oh well. So, now, actually, looking at it, why don't we make this bright green? Why don't we not do that? On the other hand, most of the stuff is actually bright green here. We could make the inside. Now, let's, let's change the ramp. Let's make it a blue outside. I don't like the blue, really. We're gonna go with the green regardless. Can we go with this green? Yeah, this doesn't look so bad. And then I do want a blue inside. Because, uh, right, color theming? Yep. And I guess these canoes are okay. Wonder though. <laughs> they look like marzipan, <laughs> you know, <laughs> candy stuff now. <laughs> uh. Yeah, let's call them, let's call this, uh, the candy shop. Splash. Thingy. <laughs> no, let's remove that. And candy shop. Uh, candy lock shop. Not that you can buy anything in there, but that's just minor details. I don't know, there's no ratings, but the guys do seem to dig it though, so I guess we're cool. Now this is not going to generate lots of vomit, so I'll actually leave it with the staff. But then, ooh, we got ah uh, yes, 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 yes. We got a wooden twister roller coaster. Oh, that's perfect. That's exactly the kind of thing that I need. Marvelous. All right. So and then we are gonna shoot for a green path over here on the exact other side of our park. How cool is that? All right. Now, of course, I think that you'll know what will happen with that color scheming thing idea that I had. But, um, yeah. Because then, that it should, you know, it should also really finish our park a bit. Now this, of course, needs interiorating. And not deteriorating. Look at the amount of gas that go up here, man. Wow, straight away. And there's not nothing here yet. It's just a big pier, really. <laughs> there's nothing here to see or look at. Now let's place a few of these down, because I, I feel like I've been neglecting these <laughs> actually for like a long while. Hey, and I also see, uh, yeah, my bubble has lost its magic. So I guess that we could get this down to two bucks and then people should go on it. Yeah, two bucks. Look, peeps go on it. We fixed it. That's good. Now then, wooden twister coaster. I want you. And um, seeing as there's a slide over there, which has broken down and won't cause any pileups because it has Imba design, let's just, uh, you know, continue construction over here actually. And coming to think of that, why don't we expand the path over here a bit? Till, say, like over here or so. Yes, that's where I want it. Uh, before we do that though, <laughs> maybe get some stuff out here. Just a hunch, you know, just an idea. <laughs> Nothing really needed, but... Oh man. Yeah, I just want to build that coaster so badly. You know, so. And that's what we will do right now. And there's more than time for it. So, build custom design and... You know what, let's... Because this one can go up really high, what we will do is just have it be... And this over here doesn't have any high tracks really, so what I'll do is I'll have the coaster be like somewhere around here. I will keep it above high 9. And it will use up like uh, this area over here, you know? With the high part being above over there. Oh man. 
planning ideas if I have them all. So, and because we got quite a bit of cash now to spend on this coast, eh, we're gonna have it be quite high up. I think 24 is like the highest we have went so far. So I guess it's quite imba. At least in compared to the rest of our coasters it should be. Now how cool would it be if we can go right not below here because there's the entrance so the game won't allow us to go below there. And that's actually a, a bit of an issue. So this is what we need to do. And now we are right above the splash thingy. Hmm. No, I guess well, this is the only way we can deal with it. Nothing bad though, nothing bad though. It's gonna be cool. So right now I want a helix down large. Just because. And then a helix down small. Okay, <laughs> I don't want it. <laughs> well, I do, but not over there. Because right now it should be possible. Uh, a small one? A curve? Yeah, a curve though works. Cool, I'm fine with that. And then another drop. Yeah, about that drop. Let's not go over there though. No, right, let's just have a regular drop, really. And seeing as I'm breaking good habits here, let's build these two. Now, I'm not so worried about hooking those up though, because uh, <laughs> this is a new, you know, empty area in our park that we can fill up at our leisure. And that's exactly what I'm doing right here. You know what, let's just have a helix up large and then have it, you know, no, not down, up small. Like so. I think that's pretty cool. We haven't had those uh, in many of our coasters so far. This though, I know, I'm not all that convinced about. We can go down, however. Well, not over here, but over here we can. However, I really, really want to keep this above height 9. Oh, this is height 11, actually. Perfect, look. See, I'm blowing uh, quite a bit more cash on this uh, coaster, as you can see. But um, I hope that's going to be reflected in the ratings. Oh, balls. All right. So this is really the only track option. Um, yeah, actually, why don't we not go with uh, this curve, but this one. Because if I'm right, we haven't used any of its special features yet. And I kind of do want to. Yeah, so that's not gonna happen over there. Oh, we are actually right below it. So that's not good either. So, instead... Let's use these over here. Which is a boring long straight part, but... Alright. Oh, crap. No, 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 that's not gonna work. I wanted to shoot through here, but there's no way that's ever gonna happen. So instead, what we will do is uh, go with our original plan here. Um, and why don't we see this over here? Now, what I want to do ideally, but I have to see whether or not that's possible, is drop down, you know, just make like a drop of sorts. Yeah, cool, we can do it. At height 9, because right now we're at the station height, at the path height actually. And then I want to, you know, shoot upwards. Because uh, there's still not the special track feature that it's unique to this coaster only in there. And I do want it. However, I think that over here is actually the better place to put one. But... Yeah. Mm, not over there though. Maybe to the other side? No. Alright. Alright, alright. Let's just... And then, good. I don't want to, you know, build it across this part, uh, further up than this pylon, because I do want to hook up other rides, you know. Now, over here, though, <laughs> I think that this will be needed. 
And I also think that <laughs> we should s start seeing this thing back to the track. Oh, and I touched the mic there. <laughs> Sorry if you heard that. Um, oh man, this is so not gonna work. <laughs> uh, so let's try it anyway. <laughs> yeah, you know what? Let's have a small curve here. And... Um, oh... Is it just me, or can we get this back over here by dropping down? Seems to me that this is a perfect, viable way of getting it back to the station. Somehow. Now, let's insert a break over here, right? Because this is station return uh, territory here. So I think that this should work. Look! Haha! <laughs> wow! Okay, I'm really pleased about this. Maybe I could actually change this around a bit. By not having that be... Um, is this a possibility? Oh, balls. One earlier. And then brakes, and then an S-band. No. I need the S-Band to be right there, but we can have the brakes be over here, though. This will work, I guess. I hope, at least. Yes! Wow. Alright. Wow. So, I think that this is quite the coaster. Seeing as we're a bit later up in the park, I think that it also shows in the coaster design. Damn, man. This is quite an Imba track. And then we get like <laughs> a 15 intensity rating for it. <laughs> no, I hope not, but uh, I have pretty good hopes for this track now. I think it has some, you know, it has the length now. We still got like four grants left, which is good. Oh, come on, stop bugging. Stop spazzing out here. Good. Look, and the speed is reasonable on it, which is uh, excellent news. See? Speed is excellent. Oh, that lift over there wasn't even needed, actually. I thought that... You know, but I think it's better safe than sorry, really. So, But yeah, it looks good. It looks... I mean, for goodness sake. Oh, man. No, I just want it to be... Yeah, there. Finally. See, game, it isn't so hard. Alrighty, so, what are the ratings? Uh, it might actually not all be all that great, looking at the numbers here. It is, actually. <laughs> well, it's, it's nothing exceptional, I guess, you know, but it's up there with pretty much all our other coasters we've built so far. So, I guess in that respect, <laughs> we're doing okay. <laughs> It seems that, you know, a 7 excitement rating is just the average coaster that I make now. I mean, <laughs> you know, we're getting that good in building all these coasters that uh, this is just what we end up with. Uh, I don't mind that, really, though. Um, do I want this over here? Yeah, I guess I do want it over there. What I also want over there is new stuff. Because, yeah, see, this area here isn't covered. And, <laughs> bam, <laughs> everything turns to shit with the supports on. <laughs> um, yeah, you know what we also kind of need? And I know I need to set this up, but uh, in hindsight, I kind of forgot about this. But we need this stuff out here, too. Because it is important. It is paramount to the success of our park. Oh, and you know what? Let's set up the colors on this one. Let's go with uh, uh, gold. I don't think we have golden umbrellas yet. So. Then, yeah, we need some of this crud. Open. Mm. And then, let's get like two toilets out there. Oh, oh, really? We get suspended monorail? I mean, I'm complaining about us not having enough rides, and this is what I get, you know? 
thanks for listening to me, research department. I really appreciate it. <laughs> there will be no payment this month for you. Okay. <laughs> All the shit you research, I don't need it. <laughs> um, so yeah, I guess we covered in that department. So what do we have now? Nothing new over here. And cycle monorail. Oh no, really? Oh, balls. Well, I mean, I just guess that we just have to build one of those then. Um, you know what? Screw the gentle rides, because we got plenty of those. I don't need them anymore. All I need now is coasters and thrill rides. And speaking of which, let's, you know, tune this one a bit. Because, um, first of all, it needs coloring. And right now, we are going to use new coloring for this. Um, do I want it to be a red guide rail? I don't know, we could go with the yellow. No, 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 no. I want this to be a red guide rail with a bit of an orangey track. And then, instead of... If I go with black, how does that look? Man, that looks sexy though. You know, in regards to the rest of the color scheme, how the... Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, this doesn't look so bad, though. Now, we'll go with black and... Uh, I don't know. Black and uh, purple? Yeah. Alright, I'm liking it. So... <coughs> excuse me. How about we call this uh, the... Sub-Sendometer. Uh, you know what? Draw or not. Uh, I wanted to have some bridge theming, but... Um, uh, you know, yeah. Erasmus. Alright, bridge theming right there for ya. Um, good stuff. Um, so, I think... Yeah, we need to... A, evaluate the pricing on our rides a bit, because look, over here, there's the rowing attraction. Nobody is going on it anymore. Look, what? Fucking five grand? For a rowing attraction? <laughs> I mean, you you just get tired, <laughs> and they get, you know, they, it made five grand of profit? Wow. I know one thing from now on, that the rowing attraction is going to be a standard part of my parks in the every future where we have water, you know, because um, that it, it's up there with the ship in terms of profit making. Damn, man, that's... wow. <laughs> I have really undervalued these rowing attractions up until now, but um, I learned my lesson, <laughs> that's uh, for sure. <laughs> Damn, man, <laughs> those things are good. And profit making those, I mean, <laughs> for the life of me, I wouldn't go on to one, but damn, man, five grand. Anyway, look, this coaster here is in our new color scheming, so it is good. But um, in terms of. And we get another roller coaster. Do I want it? No, I actually don't, so I'll untick this. Now. The reason I passed it is because I'm kind of a bit in dubio about what to do next. Um, either build this, but this is kind of a thing that I actually, you know, we checked this out uh, like uh, in the last park, and it was horrible. <laughs> I mean, I thought I made an inbound track with it, you know, going underground, making curves, seeing the scenery, and doing whatever, <laughs> and it just had horrible ratings. Now this is just, it cannot be built because of this. So basically we don't have anything to build. Which is exactly what I feared, other than the coaster coming up. So I guess the only real thing that I can do is building that coaster. Whenever it becomes available, which is quite a while still. So, dilemmas, dilemmas. What we will do next, find that out next time when I play more of Rollercoaster Tycoon.